What if you could step inside a video game, walk through ancient ruins, or stand on Mars, all without leaving your room? What once sounded like science fiction is now becoming reality. Virtual reality, or VR, is no longer just a futuristic concept. It's rising, fast, and it's quietly reshaping how we play, learn, connect, and even live. The dream of VR isn't new. For decades, inventors and tech pioneers imagined a world where you could plug into a fully immersive experience. But back then, the tech just wasn't there. It was bulky, glitchy, and far too expensive for everyday people. Fast forward to today, and the story is changing. Headsets are getting lighter, graphics are more realistic, movement feels natural, and most importantly, it's becoming accessible. What was once reserved for labs and arcades is now sitting in living rooms around the world. Gaming has always led the charge, and in VR, it's no different. Imagine not just playing a game, but living inside it. Sword fighting with real motion, solving puzzles by physically walking around a room, or surviving horror scenes that make your heart race for real. Titles like Half-Life, Alex, Asgard's Wrath 2, and Beat Saber aren't just games. Their experiences, blurring the line between digital and physical. And every year, developers are pushing what's possible. The limits of the screen? Gone. In VR, you are the character. But VR's impact goes way beyond gaming. It's transforming education, health, and daily life. Students are learning history by walking through ancient cities. Therapists are using VR to treat phobias and PTSD. Artists are painting in 3D space. Even fitness has changed, with people burning calories in virtual boxing rings or dancing to rhythm games that feel more like a party than a workout. And then there's social connection, meeting friends in digital worlds, hosting events, attending live concerts. For many, VR is becoming a new kind of third place, a virtual gathering ground. We're just scratching the surface. As headsets get smarter, wireless, and more intuitive, virtual reality will become part of everyday life. Whether it's work, creativity, travel, or healing, VR is carving out its place in our world. It's not about escaping reality. It's about expanding it. So, the question isn't if VR is the future. It's how soon you'll step into it.